Historical Society, known as the History Center, is celebrating a prestigious award for a program that captures the stories of those who have made a real impact in Lynn County. Jason Wright, Executive Director of the History Center, joins us now. So this is for the Oral Histories Live program. Give us a little bit of the backstory about the program and where it stands today. The backstory is actually when I first started with the History Center back in 2015, I had a volunteer come into my office and uh, someone had just passed away and they said, we just lost that story forever. And it stuck with me. Mm -hmm. And um, and it kind of gnawed at me. And, and when I went home that night, being a child of the 70s, I always used television as my research. And so, <laughs> and my inspiration. So I was flipping channels, landed on the Bravo channel. And uh, there's a show called Inside the Actor's Studio. Mm -hmm. I started watching it. Wonderful interviewer. Great experience. Very entertaining. And I thought, most non profit museums like ours do these oral histories in a booth with just the interviewer and the interviewee. Why don't we take this model and do it in front of an audience? Absolutely. And it took off. It from the from the get go. We were at that point we didn't have our building, so we did it at the at the, at the library. Great crowd and the experience was so wonderful and and it's been going on since then. Why is it important to capture stories and history in this way? Um, it's, it is getting something we like to call primary source from the horse's mouth. Right. These are the people that have experienced it. Mm -hmm. These are the, the kind of things that, that aren't always captured. As a matter of fact, I could probably just even ask you, don't you wish you had your great-grandparents' stories? Oh, sure. Exactly. And in their own words, have their voice recorded. Exactly. Yeah. And when, you, when we get stories like Mr. Ginsburg, Herman Ginsburg, extraordinary retailer downtown, um, great sense of humor, actually. For those of your viewers that would like to have a great laugh, go to our website and look at his. <laughs> he's, he's an amazing man. But having to be a downtown retailer at that time, but also of the Jewish faith, mm -hmm. he was able to tell us exactly what he felt, what it was like, and those stories are getting lost. Well, and we're in the business of interviewing, and we like to hear directly from people. So I feel like we understand where y'all are coming from with having to record history this way. Exactly. So let's talk about the award. What does this award mean for the History Center? I got to tell you, the people of Lynn County and everybody that comes to our museum, they know what killer programs we have. We have an amazing program director and a terrific team. We all know how great our programs are. This means the nation knows that we do it one better. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I got to tell you, I got a wonderful call from one of the reviewers. They, they actually gave me a little hint that we, that we had won. And she told me that nobody's doing this out there. We are unique in that we are doing something that is so critical to, pr to preserve history, but we're also entertaining people. Mm -hmm. And, and it's, it's one of those, look out, you might actually learn something too right. kind of experiences. So that's why we're doing this. Great. And you can find these oral histories on your website. Absolutely. We post-produced them. Post-produced them. Mm -hmm. And so they are extraordinary quality. And there are dozens of them there. And you can learn so much about not only Lynn County history, but history in general. And the people who have walked among us and really made a difference. In exactly, the a huge difference. Jason Wright, Executive Director of the History Center, thanks for coming in today. Been my pleasure. Now.